another video this video is actually going to show you the last couple of months between myself and Dustin through a series of video exchanges mostly from Dustin because he likes taking videos <laughs> it's true he really does so you're going to get to see the time from when he was released through the Christmas holidays up into January and then after that we are actually going to start vlogging so I'm going to be doing weekly vlogs. So I hope you follow us on our journey. Um, Dustin talks a lot about what he's up to with his treatment, work, housing, everything. So with that, let's get into the video and don't forget to like and subscribe and comment. Honestly, your comments are truly welcomed. So with that, let's go. Right, so I'm really, really hoping that I get to speak to him tonight. I haven't spoken to him for two and a half months, so it's been a long time. Okay, so this was the day. This was the day that Dustin was going to be released. It was a mixture of emotions. It was kind of like, I can't believe it. I hadn't spoken to him for over two months. I hadn't seen him in video form for over a year. <laughs> okay, this next clip is when he rang me from Colorado Airport and I hadn't spoken to him for months. And yet I'm lying on my bed. Hi. Oh, oh my Hi, God. Baby. Hey. I'm so happy to talk to you. I know, it's hey, been like two and a half months. I love months. you so much. I Noelle, love you. you. Hey, I've been sending you a bunch of letters. I sent you out another one tonight. Guess what I got last night when I got my property? I don't know. I got the 20 things to do in Utah letter. No. <laughs> I haven't answered it yet because obviously it's a, it's a letter in its own, but I sent you another one last night with a bunch of stamps on it because I only had one envelope. So but you, should have some, you should have a bunch of letters been coming. Oh. But I'm in Denver right now at the Denver airport working yet but but yeah i won't have a phone until tomorrow my brother i told him i want him to eat so i'm not taking you at four o'clock in the morning bro <laughs> I said, well they open up <laughs> that's all right are we good uh, yes and i know i know you've been having to ounce are we good we are good aren't we <laughs> Okay. I'm just, good. just I'm get, on that, you, get, get on that, get on that flight. Get on that flight with yeah, a smile on your face. <laughs> you know? Yeah. Huh? I love you, sweetheart. I love I'll you talk too. To you really, really soon, okay? That's alright. Have a good flight. <laughs> Have a good flight. I'm gonna, uh, I'm gonna be creepy. I'm reading the book too on the flight. I'm reading uh, Sycamore Row by John Grisham. <laughs> Are you fed up now, with books? Yeah, why everybody's freaking on their phones. I gotta be reading a book. <laughs> uh, that's archaic. Okay, bye, All baby. Right. Okay, bye. Love you. I love you. Bye. Bye. Love you too. Bye. Bye. I just remember I was so nervous and so full of excitement. <laughs> So Dustin got released on that Friday by the Saturday he had a phone and this was his first video message to me. Uh, it was exciting, it was nerve wracking, but also I think what hit home was just how frail he looked and very sickly and it really hit home. The trauma and oh, you just, everything he'd gone through this past year and I kind of... I saw somebody who was broken, but I knew that this was the start of a new journey, and wow, it has been. Maybe just sending you a little something, a little shout out, I love you, and I can't wait to see you, and, and it's a day tonight, and we're going to talk, and I'm so nervous right now, I don't know why, but yeah, I, I, I love you, and um, this is going to be the new look for a minute, I guess, Tommy helped me pick all this out, so I love you, baby, bye.
So Dustin managed to get accommodation in Sober Living and here he is showing you around the accommodation. So, here we go. Okay, so this is light from one end to the other. So you got all your little, my fridge and my microwave and all my pots and pans and my food. And I got my little cook stuff over there in the corner. And you know I got that cereal. No, I do, huh? No seasonings. Cleaning stuff. Mm -hmm. That English muffins today and thought about you. You know that, right? You're my English baby. So yeah, and then that's a pretty good little coffee pot. That coffee was delicious this morning. That ice cream, butter pecan. Wish we could eat that together. And then I bought a bunch of uh, limes and tomatoes and, and uh, onions and jalapenos. And I'm going to make a fresh salsa. <laughs> I'm a little get a juice down there because I'm a little addict. But... So yeah, oh, here's my bed, my little clothes rack, got all my stuff neat. You, you would, I'm a pretty neat person, babe, so I don't really like clutter, but I love you. And if clutter comes with you, baby, I love the clutter. So yeah, so that's it. And we're going to go out here. Okay. So... The next lot of footage is actually Christmas in Salt Lake and it shows you some of the sights around Salt Lake that Dustin took for me and he even went bag shopping for me. The one to display. This guy's still here. I cannot believe that. Look how old they are. Stockings. But he like sells antique coins and stuff here. This guy does. See that's falling right in the middle of the mall? Macy's. You know, jelly beans, babe. It's cute. Looks like it's held up by a really, like a real gold look, though. That's kind of cool. They yeah, use one of their little cheap bracelets or something they sell, huh? Might as well do some window shopping over here. I really like those earrings. And that green and that bracelet, that's really beautiful. That little toy soldier, huh? That's a nice watch. It's really nice. <laughs> Called the Sky Bridge. Oh, this is a beautiful city. Amazing over there. Very nice, huh? Yeah, I love you, bye. I'm walking, check this out. I didn't even know this is over here. It's like a little town square. I know there's skating over here, ice skating somewhere too. I would love to find. I want to do that when you're here. If they, well, it'll be too late then, but like sometime when you come back. This thing's lit up like with lights right now. Well, it's kind of cool. 
But no, it ain't. It's just glass. Okay, it's just like reflective glass, but it looked like it was lit up. Kate Spade. I know she's pretty popular, isn't she? I think I could do good getting you a bag, babe. You know that? I think I would do good. I'd get you like a Kate Spade, probably. I've heard about her as like David Spade's sister or some shit, wasn't it? You'll never find a man that'll do this for you. I, I promise you that. I am the one. And he even took a video of a ring he thought I might like. Oh, I wonder what that might be for. So exciting. Bags and rings. A girl's best friend. <laughs> so me and Dustin discussed about videoing my mom and doing a video visit. My mom is really nervous. She's very shy. She's very quiet. She doesn't like technology and everything. But we actually locked her down and we did it on Christmas Eve. Um, I just finished work. I was so nervous, so nervous. My mum was nervous, but here is some of the footage. I can, I, sorry, this, I had to film this by my phone um, off my computer screen, so that's why you get that look of being filmed. I didn't know how to download it from my MacBook to WhatsApp. MacBooks are just so complicated. <laughs> they really are, well to me they are. So here is that footage of some of the video call with my mom and Dustin and me. I remember being really, really nervous. So here we go. Okay. Hello. Hello. She's got she's she's got a hot water. Sorry, I've got some hot water I'm cold. Fine, thank you. How are you? I'm pretty good. I'm going inside right now, so just give me a second. I'm going to take off my coat, okay? Oh, okay. Great. Hi, baby. <laughs> How are you? I'm fine, thank you. I've just yeah, finished work. Good to see you guys. Yeah. And you, and you think I... I'm you... nervous. I'm just as nervous. Yeah, so am I. And I... We did why like a nervous? Nervous. I'm not nervous. I don't know why I'm nervous. I'm just down. No, I actually wished you happy birthday 20 minutes before the day ended. Uh, in America. Yeah. <laughs> I wish I could say better late than never, but, you know, damage was well, done. What happened, what happened is I, I logged on to Facebook, and I see your picture with a little birthday cake next to it and said, hey, why don't anybody who knows Sarah wish her happy birthday? And I, I said, it ain't her birthday. And then I looked December 22nd. Oh, shit. <laughs> I didn't know it was the, the 22nd of December. I didn't know. I mean, it is what it is, but... And then I started stalking her on all her social media. I went to everything she's ever been on. I was going to TikTok next. Because <laughs> <laughs> ever said. I put on like 12 pounds. Yeah, so, so you're recovering well. I'm recovering well, yes. Mm -hmm. Yeah, she's been a big part of that. She doesn't like to take credit, but... She's oh, I do. I just, I just, I just coy with you. But I'm like, pat myself on the back. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But yeah, it's 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 pretty amazing to, to to be able to walk outside at night and look at the stars and and I drag her with me a lot. Yeah. So. <laughs> yeah. God, I'm a lucky man. Yeah. You. you know that? Uh, <laughs> Very lucky. But, but. <laughs> <laughs> so my mum would be glad to just get me off her hands, I think. <laughs> no, I don't say that. No. Are you still using her car? Yeah. Yes, is, is it all right, my car? It's lovely, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> is that a sore subject? Can I talk about it? <laughs> Yeah, right, we're going to go because I need to get home. I need to have some dinner. Okay. Okay. Nice to have met okay. you. Well, Anita, you know, I'm so glad that she's cutting us off, but you have a good night, okay? E even if you wasn't ready to leave, she's, she's leaving, so. Okay. What time, baby? Stop it. What time, baby? Uh, I'll, I'll text you when I get home because I need to have a bath and have some dinner. <laughs> okay, so I don't know. I'll just catch on one of them. Okay. Okay. Bye. Right. Hey, I, I, I love you so very much. Hello. Anita, it was nice getting to meet you. It was nice to meet you, Dustin. 
so the the last few months it really has been a time for me and Dustin to really get to know each other just even down to you know watching each other's mannerisms how we respond to things we've done a lot of talking we have talked a lot about the future and how we're going to achieve it and we've we've just talked about everything and anything and it we needed this we needed this to actually make sure that we still felt the same way because although we'd corresponded through little videos and letter writing and calls we never really just sat down and looked at each other and really just talked and looked at how we respond to each other and that is something that over time I am getting more comfortable with like I'm quite I'm quite cheeky now with him <laughs> like I I think I probably push my boundaries with him a little bit but he lets me so that's good <laughs> Feel like a stone in a well No one can find me here Pretending it's no it all in So I can just stay in here You know I see the worst It's me who made you better you like this video I feel like it's a bit of a mix match of many different things but please like and subscribe I hope you're going to follow us on our journey remember that the you can ask any questions you know I'm not saying we're going to answer everything but you can certainly ask them anyway I hope you enjoy this video until the next video which is going to be a vlog bye